these regions, putting in work with the characters, and since there hasn't been that major, there hasn't been that breakthrough Byleth performance yet with anyone other than Leo, but yeah. the character is still slowly just creeping its way there. Yeah, I was, I was really hoping to see um, uh, Pelo Pelo pop off mm -hmm. as well, uh, the offline era. That hasn't happened yet, but... Uh, yeah, here we go. Oh, we're gonna get a battle of the DLC, baby. Here we go. Mexico's number one versus Hawaii's number five. An intercontinental rivalry. Uh, that up air hitbox is so, it's like, it, it's very comparable almost to Palutena's up air, but just a little less um, impactful, but Leo made such, a, such good use of it. Yeah, the hitbox shape's slightly different, but Leo is able to make use of it nonetheless, and still going through top of landing. Excellent S-Mash call out there by Ann. That crafting oh, table back? <laughs> in the way. This time, though, well-spaced on the backer from Leo. You love the confidence from Ann. Not many players can just look at the best player in the world and not blame to just keep mining away. Yeah. Yeah. Leo's getting a lot out of these jump callouts, but Ann is still landing successfully. It's good back and forth so far. Yeah, good awareness from Ann as well to spot dodge that arrow. You do have enough time to react to it, but Leo finds that ah. down tilt up air. Just going to live. Great the eye. And the minecart actually beating out the side B from Leo. Oh my gosh, Leo pinpoint uh, patience there in order to land the big hit. Ooh, oh, the, the block, block actually saving and coming to his rescue. Saved by the block, but and ah, oh, finally gonna have a stock carrot as Leo swings away with those deadly tilts. Yeah, you only get to escape death against players like MK Leo so many times. Right. Uh, the steel poke there leading to a nice string for Leo. Good spot dodge from Ange once again, but through with that landing fair as he still hunts for that. Leo's hunting. Nice use of the, just the, the last few hits. And what a, what a tech from ledge for Leo. Leo's fine and comfortable making his home at ledge because, again, best player in the world. What do you say? On the the platform, and going to take the time to mine a little bit more. Oh, but what an excellent trap set by Ange. He's going to come away with the stop, but Leo immediately... Punish the end from the angle platform. Nice elytra angle as well, but still can't escape the ledge. And, oh, Dibs Leo gift. Oh! Oh! Now you can't touch me! Can't touch me with that arrow. It's I like know he's playing exactly. a rhythm game. <laughs> oh. oh! An up smash whiff returned with an up smash. Yeah, has to be aware that that's such a massive commitment, and the swoop on the up smash is immaculate from Leo. It, it doesn't really feel like that huge of a commitment for uh, Steve, just because of the scoop, but when it whips, you're right. Wow! Detailed down smash. My man's just going to cover the ground with as many hitboxes as possible, but Leo immediately putting Ann into the cyclone there. Oh, he thought he had Steve Minecart and didn't quite do it. And just menacingly mining away. Yeah, and has only been able to land mostly sour spots on some of these diamond tools, so Leo isn't even at too high of a percent yet. Ooh, nice escape by and Oh, but that time he could not spot dodge the arrow. Leo just immediately knows exactly to keep pressing buttons in this situation. Does tech, so still gonna live for now. That double block set up. Leo has a slight window with Woo! the arrows, but with Anne's awareness and- Oh man, pitch and catch there with the up smash, catching Leo out of the minecart. And trying to press the issue right now to get back into this one. Barely surviving being swiped away. Barely avoids the fair ledge and is just unable to avoid the constant barrage of hitboxes there at the end. MPLA winning game one handily. Yeah, that's the same setups that you've seen over and over again, not just this weekend, but throughout the past month at Summit and the Mexican Open for yeah. Smash World Tour. And this is just, uh, there, I, it's there not a character that a lot of people have in region, per se, at Leo's no, level. No, 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 no. <laughs> you do, I mean, well, no one has. I mean, if you are Mexican, you have one. It's Leo yes. himself, but. That depends on where in Mexico you are. Yes. <laughs> Mexico's a very large country. <laughs> uh, there was one thing I was going to oh, we're going to see Ann's well, There was one thing early that really set the pace, and that Leo had like a one-two setup out of down tilt. He could have immediately pressed another button to get a very simple combo, and he held back. Mm -hmm. And then that set the table for later on when Leo was just immediately pressing as many options as he could whenever he got in Andy's range. But here we go, the wolf. It's going to be a different change of pace here. Andy's going to have to press the issue. 
And right now, he is just falling free to play oh, his no. combo game. You can't pull a fast one like that, especially with that end lag on Flash. Oh my gosh. And the Nair to down, uh, uh, dash attack there is to do it. Leo on fire to start off game two. Defensive area bar as well as Leo marauds his way back to center stage. Wow, and he's able to use the upbeat command route to basically set up further ledge traps too, just by the way the end has to force the eye. Even when Leo's facing away from ledge, he's able to force his opponent to ledge. Yeah, I think And went for that down throw, realized he was out of down throw dash attack percent, so just had to wait for the option, and Leo escaped. Oh, nice, nice by Leo. Oh, excellent use the reflector. I love aggressive reflector usage by Wolves. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh! And barely pulled out the defensive option there in time. Yeah, Wolf's Reflector at frame six faster than any of his aerials, but oh. no amount of Reflector speed, or at least not enough, is able to save and there. Leo was like, my arrow's love is true, baby. He let it fly. Right now, I mean, Anne is just in one of the worst positions you could be in. In one of the worst possible situations, <laughs> the man. Oh, and Leo was able to use the full arrow to get off stage and immediately pop this man with the side B. Yeah, He's yeah. feeling himself. Wow, I, did you see that? Just, he crouched to avoid the aerial. Oh, man. Oh, he's trying to try to give him the move so nice. He did it twice, not to get the up air, but gets the gentleman and to ledge. Leo going up deep. Oh, my God. He's trying to pull and down to the hell with a nice recovery. And right now, feverishly trying to figure out the calculator way back into this one. The door is being shut tight, but there's still a chance. Leo on the verge of a three stock. This will be an opportunity as he just pummels him over and over again. Attempts the snipe, doesn't do it. Oh my gosh, he almost got the follow up there. Harry is going to do it. And there we go. The best in the world. And what he does, put an and to sleep. Yeah, Leo, again, a quick fist bump. Even the fist bump afterwards, it's quick, it's efficient. <laughs> he made that entire set look routine.